to the first Dawn of War 3 tutorial. This first tutorial will teach the basic gameplay mechanics you need to know in order to play Dawn of War 3, such as basic combat and base and army building. For the purpose of this tutorial, you will be playing as Space Marines. Move the game camera towards your stronghold. The Space Marines start with the Stronghold as their headquarter building. The Stronghold is used to deploy builder units and basic combat units. We will begin by setting a rally point from your Stronghold onto the battlefield. Set a rally point at the indicated position. Good work. The rally point has been set. When you deploy units from your stronghold, they will immediately move to the rally point. Next, we will build your forces, starting with a tactical marine squad. Deploy a tactical marine squad from your stronghold. Tacticals. Tactical marines are a ranged infantry unit that serves as the space marine's basic line unit. Tactical Marine Squad. Your Tactical Marine Squad is deployed. Tactical Marines ready. In order to build other kinds of units, you will need to construct additional kinds of base buildings. Base buildings are constructed by builder units. The Space Marine Builder Unit is the Servitor. Deploy a Servitor from your stronghold. The Servitor is weak in combat, but is able to construct additional base buildings. These buildings can be used to deploy new kinds of units. To build a new base building, select your Servitor and move it to the indicated build location. Your servitor to the build location. This one to specified coordinates. Construct a barracks at the indicated build location. Construct a barracks. Barracks will be made according to new kinds of units. Like your stronghold, you can also set a rally point by selecting your barracks and then issuing a right click on the battlefield. We will now deploy assault marines from your new barracks. Deploy two assault marine squads from your barracks. Preparing Units that are in progress are added to your build queue at the bottom of the screen. When a unit is finished, the next unit in the build queue will become in progress. This allows you to queue up several units for deployment at once. Your first Assault Marine squad is finished. Unlike Tactical Marines, Assault Marines specialize in melee combat instead of ranged combat. They are equipped with jump packs and cost more resources to deploy. All of your Assault Marine squads are deployed. You are ready to take your forces into battle. You can select multiple units at once by box selecting a group of units. Click and drag to box select all of your units at once. Witness excellence. 
To more easily manage your units, you can assign your selected units into control groups. Assign your tactical and assault marines to a control group. To help you better manage different it kinds of units, they can be put in multiple control groups at once. There is enemy activity behind the fog of war. They will appear once your units are close enough to see them. Find the enemy behind the fog of war and eliminate them. Yes, so it is my duty to oblige. Right click on the enemy to attack. squad's health by moving it over to a pickup. There are more enemies ahead. ahead. This time, we will move your units with the attack move command. Units using attack move will move to the specified location and automatically stop to attack enemies encountered along the way. Issue an attack move command to move your units. We'll pray for Destroy the enemy. The enemy. As you would have it. That is that. Attack move is more safe, efficient, and effective than using the right click move. Right click move is for positioning units within combat or for escaping combat. Learning which move command is appropriate to the situation at hand will make you a better commander. The enemy is trying to gain a tactical advantage by capturing that heavy cover. Capturing heavy cover activates a shield that protects the units inside from ranged damage. Your ranged units cannot enter heavy cover that has been captured by the enemy. Only units with the counter cover property, such as assault marines, can enter captured heavy cover and fight enemy units inside. Since the heavy cover is located on higher ground, your squads cannot reach it on foot. Make Use your progress. assault marines jump ability to leap them into the heavy cover. It is also possible to destroy heavy cover with ranged damage. Destroy the enemy. Assault jump understood. We are ready for war. Tactical squad on the move. Jump, jump, jump. Okay. Assault squad places enemy foot soldiers. Tactical squad going now. Destroy the enemy. purposes of this tutorial, you have been granted an additional squad. This squad has suffered a casualty and is no longer at full strength. We will reinforce this squad back up to full strength. Move this damaged unit to your stronghold or barracks to begin reinforcement. It costs resources to reinforce a squad, but it is always cheaper than purchasing a new squad. Enforcement. Assault jump understood. Forging ahead. To 
see if your unit is within reinforcement range, simply select the building and view the rotating reinforcement reticule on the ground. The squad's reinforcement will pause if it moves away from the reinforcement structure. Reinforcement will resume once the squad moves back into range of the reinforcement structure. Move this squad to a base building for reinforcement. has been reinforced. A fully reinforced squad is always stronger than one who has taken casualties. The enemy is preparing to mount an attack on your base. We will deploy two scout sniper squads to bolster your defenses. Deploy two scout sniper squads from your barracks. Scout snipers have a larger line of sight and firing range than other Space Marine line units. You can use scout snipers to see and attack enemies that are much further away. Your first squad of scout snipers has been deployed. Deploy one more scout sniper squad from your barracks. They are weak against melee attackers, so keep them stationed behind your other units. Your scout snipers are ready for combat. The enemy is marching towards your stronghold. Position your units to intercept the enemy attack. Yeah. 